shit, three. Shit, three. Oh, I messed up. Gotta start all over again. I hated them phones as a kid. Well, let's see what else we got here. We got the barber shop here. I mean, a lot of time and money and effort went in. Whoever built this place, a lot of time and money went into the effort of this place because there's a lot of good construction done in here and somebody spent a lot of time remodeling this place. I bet you they spent a freaking fortune on remodeling that old style cash register. That's really cool, man. I wonder if it's operational. Absolutely. Here's your change, sir. What's that say? Fountain service. All the fake fruits and vegetables. Anyway, uh, I have to give you guys something to watch today. You know what I mean? Thank you for turning it into the Universal Fight League. I don't know if I'm gonna film the meeting between me and him, because he said he really didn't want to be on the channel, but he is a fan of the show. So we'll see what happens with that. But one thing I promise you guys, that as soon as I know, you'll know. So again, I know I sound like a broken record saying thank you to all you guys, but thank you. Purge Clan, what's up? HJJ, what's up? Um, I can't remember the guys' names that have donated to the channel. Uh, I do have a Patreon account. It's under review right now. So you guys are gonna be able to get your donations in. And I'm sorry the merch line is taking so long, but my life's kind of crazy with fighting child support and everything else like that, that I don't really have the cash to start my merch line. So if there's any of you out there that want to uh, keep donating to the channel to help me get the merch line going, you guys are going to absolutely love it when you guys see what it is, because I've already got all the designs done, because we're going to have hats, we're going to have shirts, hoodies and backpacks that's what we're going to i just don't have the capital to get it off the ground now i've been told that there's companies out there that are sponsoring my youtube channel as far as merch lines goes but i don't know how to go about all that i'm just learning here you know i've only been a youtube channel for six months so i'm working on it i'm working on it but i really want to get this merch line done because our designs are awesome so again, please hit that like button. Please hit that subscribe button. And I can't wait until we're selling out the Palace of Auburn Hills with the Universal Fight League. And only people I'll have to thank for that will be you, all my fans. I love you guys, man. And as far as like, you know, I got this guy, Anthony Baldwin, that keeps, you know, talking smack on my channel. Well, listen, I don't know what your problem is, Anthony, because the beef that I have with your teacher is between me and him. You had nothing to do with it. So I don't even know what your problem is with me. Because you remember, Anthony, when you first started talking smack on my channel? I didn't come back talking smack then. I called you on the telephone and said, hey, bro, what is your problem? It's got nothing to do with you. You're, and what, was, what did you say to me? You know exactly what you said. He was like, Billy, I got no problem with you. He goes, I'm at Master Bill's right now, so that's why I have to say this. I said, so you're only saying it. He was like, yeah, because I'm in front of them. I was like, all right, Anthony, because I got no problem with you. I liked the Anthony. I thought he was a good guy, man. But because I got ripped off, all of a sudden he wants to open his mouth with opinion. So as far as the beef between me and Anthony Baldwin, listen, Anthony, you got, I've never done anything wrong to you. You've never done anything wrong to me. So I'm ready to squash that beef right now. And I wish you the best of luck, Anthony Baldwin. You know, even to you too, man, I wish you the best of luck. I hope that you can make an honest living without having to rip everybody off. But I just wanted to stay my peace on Anthony because I don't know what his problem is with me. But anyway, I just want to say congratulations to Lee. I guess he just opened a new martial arts school over on Woodward. I'm talking to him about it. And another thing, another announcement I want to make if you made it this far in the video, when we get this building, I do want to build a team. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do an ultimate fighter style to where all 10 fighters are going to come in and they're going to compete for a spot on the Universal Fight League team. And then I'm going to sponsor them into competitions. We just haven't got that far yet. So I don't really know what else to say right now other than I love all my fans. Thank you guys and we are making headway. 
So until the next vlog, make sure you smash that like button. Make sure you smash that subscribe button and leave a comment down below on, on your thoughts of today's vlogs or if you want to fight with the Universal Fight League or you want a chance to fight on my channel to show how badass you are, you guys can email me at universalfightleague at gmail.com. You can email me at billgibbons87813 at gmail.com. You guys can text or call me at 586 343 Three seven six five, because I have nothing to hide, and I love hearing from my fans. So, like a Sean Vendenville, he's one of my fans that we talk all the time on the phone. So, hopefully, I'm going to Texas real soon to visit him. Oh, and the uh, fighting warrior brother, you just keep working at it. But the one thing I said is. Yes, you got a lot of determination and a lot of drive, but what you need, bro, is a trainer. If you got a trainer, within a year, you'll be badass because you can only go so far training yourself and you need that knowledge from somebody else on fighting so you can put that into your fight game and I promise you, you will be a badass dude if you go get a trainer. So best of luck to you, fighting warrior and 10,000 fists. I even heard from you in a while, man. What's going on, brother? You were like one of my very first supporters. He just got monetized, so go check out 10,000 fists. Hit his subscribe button, hit his like button. Also, go check out the Fighting Warrior. Good friend of mine, been supporting me from the beginning. Go check out his YouTube channel. Hit that like button on his videos and hit that subscribe button. And also, as far as my best friend on YouTube who is a gamer, that's Purge Clan, LLC. Go check out his YouTube channel. Smash his like button, smash his subscribe buttons. Because I'm not trying to do this to blow up by myself. I want to bring everybody with me that's loyal to me and that has got my back. I want to bring them all with me. So that's why I'm giving shouts out to them. So I'm going to end this vlog here because I just seen uh, my landlord walk from the building walk in. So I'm going to have this meeting and I'll let you guys know how it goes. Wish me luck. Thank you for the donations. Please keep sending them because we need a lot, a lot of money to be able to get this off the ground. Another thing I need, if anybody can help me out with, is I need speed bags. I need heavy bags. I need floor matting. I need mirrors. Anything that you're going to need inside of a dojo or any kind of training facility, that's what I'm going to need. And I'll take all donations because every dollar I save can be something I put towards something else as far as the gym goes. So, and I've already gotten so much help from everybody. That's what I need right now. I need money and a lot of equipment. So, again, smash that like button, smash that subscribe button, and until the next vlog, I love you.